We see it every holiday season, people willing to go to great lengths for their loved ones, and that includes getting on a plane. AAA says about 7.5 million people are expected to fly to their holiday destinations this year, meaning airports across the country are certainly busier than usual. And at TF Green, the holiday celebrations start right there in the arrival section. 12 News reporter Sheena Loshudo spent the day at the airport and has more on the busy travel day live from Warwick. Sheena? Well, thankfully, things are going rather smoothly here for travelers at TF Green International Airport today. The arrival section has consistently been busy all day with full bags and full hearts. You don't have to know someone to see it. I'm going to be a mess. Thank you so much. They don't take this for granted. I'm excited to see Sissy. The simple joy. She's going to be coming. She's getting off the plane. Of being together. Go, 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 go. I haven't seen her in over like six and a half years, and it's just like I just missed her so much. Like I literally, as soon as I saw her, I had to go right down. <laughs> to see my two girls be reunited after so many years, you know that pain. It's finally coming to an end. There's something about watching people reunite, which is why Kat Scavera went along for the ride to pick up her wife's cousin. At least that's the story she was told. She thought we were coming to the airport to pick up my cousin Nikki, who was surprising my aunt. So Kat? So she couldn't believe her eyes. It's Cassidy and Avery. Here they come. It's when she saw her daughter and granddaughter at the top of the escalator. Merry Christmas. Somehow the most unexpected gift is the one she always wanted. So now daughter and granddaughter and mama can be all together. I don't get to spend many Christmases with these guys, so <laughs> to be able to spend Christmas with them is a true joy and blessing. All of my daughters will be together now and all of my to, grandkids. Now we're off to surprise the other two sisters. And that's just one look at why these flights are just always worth it for these travelers that we meet. And according to AAA, this year, plane ticket prices were a bit down, making it a lot easier for people to book and, of course, reunite with everyone. And some good news for travelers. The flight board at TF Green today looking really good. Not really any big impacts. Some planes were impacted by 20 to 30 minutes, but really, at most, that's really all we saw. Sheena, thank you so much for sharing those heartfelt reunions with us. Certainly people are advised to show up at the airports early. How long is this busy period going to last? Well, right now, certainly we are right in the middle of the busy airport season today, especially, but this is going to last. You're going to see those busier crowds until about four days after Christmas this year. All right, our Sheena Loshuto live for us at TF Green in Warwick. Sheena, thank you. And right now on WPRI.com, you can find our holiday travel guide. There you can see the updated forecast, pinpoint traffic cameras, and our flight tracker. We also have tips from experts on how to make your travels for the holidays smoother. Well, a lot of you also taking to the skies as you head to your holiday destination. CF Green was busy today, but lines have been moving pretty fast. 12 News reporter Sheena Loshudo caught up with people flying home for the holidays and joins us now with details on some special reunions. Sheena? Well, just one look behind me, you can see it is packed in here. A lot of action, people waiting for their loved ones to come home. Right now, we are right in the middle of the busiest holiday period here at the airport. A lot of people thankful, though, it's going very smoothly this week because thankfully the weather this year is cooperating. Flights connect us from place to place. From the airplane seat to the arms of a loved one. <laughs> <laughs> this holiday season, millions are packing a bag to be somewhere special for Christmas. According to AAA, this is the busiest year ever for airports. It was really busy, but it was, yeah, a good flight. We woke up at like 3 o'clock this morning, so <laughs> slept on the plane. Oh yeah, <laughs> it was a good flight. <laughs> and according to travelers, so far, so good. TF Green International Airport's flight board only seeing slight impacts. 
Uh, I woke up at like four, showed up for uh, like a six o'clock boarding, and then it was pretty smooth sailing from there. I got on the plane, uh, hung out, flew, landed in Atlanta. Yeah, no line, no baggage, just got on the plane and left. It was really like, there's like no stopping. It's pretty good. Merry Christmas! Well, the arrival section is full of unforgettable reunions. How did you do this? It happened. I don't get to spend many Christmases with these guys, so to be able to spend Christmas with them is a true joy and blessing. All of my daughters will be together now and we're all of my to, grandkids. Now we're off to surprise the other two sisters. And if you still have plans to fly out anywhere, airports and airlines are suggesting that you give yourself plenty of time. Of course, it will be busier this week, and this busy travel period will last until at least four days after Christmas. Reporting live in Warwick tonight, I'm Sheena Loshudo, 12 News.